Alan's checking his crackling, which had to wait until Tom's came out of the oven. Still needs to keep cooking. Still a bit floppy, isn't it's it? It's a bit floppy. You don't want to turn the oven up, no? No, I'll just leave it as it is. Slow and steady wins the race, I think, on okay. this one. Let's the hope so. The lion knows best. The lion knows best. Patience and stealth can serve a lion well, but Alan can't afford to let his prey get too far ahead. And now he's run into a problem with his butternut squash. The words, that is <laughs> springs to mind, unfortunately. That is absolutely useless. That is about as much use as a chocolate fire guard. Do you know what? I wouldn't even bother putting that back out. I'd put it in the bin, because that is as... <laughs> Use it, Anna. We're not blaming the equipment, are we, Alan? Equipment failure. All the gear, no idea. Ah, that's better, eh? If I didn't know better, I'd have been sabotaged. Sabotaged. Tom seems to be very relaxed with this course. He's been basically watching me and goading me all day today while I've been pushing. I've got a little bit of a sweat on. Often, you don't see me sweating, so having it raised my game learning from yesterday's mistakes, and hopefully this will give him a little food for thought. With his veg mill mended, Alan swings back into action, and both the tempo and the temperature in the kitchen rise rapidly. It's really starting to pick up. The, the adrenaline's starting to flow, you know, and uh, I'm happy with my dish. I think it's all going to come together really nicely there, but, you know, this is, this is, this is, this is money time, isn't it? Feeling it yet? Uh, yeah, I'll well, actually a wee bit of a knot in my stomach at the moment. Now it starts, the heart starts pounding. Absolutely. Tom's pounding his potatoes with cabbage, spring onions and bacon. Ah, rumbledy thumbs. Rumbledy thumbs. God, you do not see this very often at all, if ever these days, actually. That's it. Such a lovely idea. The old classics. Yeah. yeah. Who's your daddy? Chef Kitchen, am I? You OK to start dressing, mate? Yeah, ready. Let's do it. Tom starts plating up with his rumbledy thumps, followed by pork shin in breadcrumbs, while Alan goes for the veg. There's that butternut puree. Tom's dish is already looking hearty, and Alan's showing his familiar flair for presentation. All the key elements are now falling neatly into place. The battle of the cracklings. But Alan is adding one final element. Sauce just coming up. And then they're ready to go. The results of a hard day's work by both men. I think we can say there's two pretty good pork dishes. Though. Good pork dishes. Ali.